This image of something in Mario that you would never think you'd see in a Mario game. I see you two watched Casper the Friendly Ghost. This is Ghostbusters for the NES, and what the fuck is this about? What do I even do? Green share at first, I'm able to tell you. Okay, I was about to say it's not letting me pause. Oh, fuck, right. I I, I used to remember how this game worked because I watched the Angry Video Game Nerd episode on it. I did too. But, uh, and I still didn't know what I was supposed <laughs> to be doing. That's all right. Did not help me at all. Are you ready? For, like, literally never doing anything in this game, Dish? <laughs> So I know you have to avoid literally everything because it'll kill you. For whatever reason, cars are merging at you because that's... Also, you can run out of gas. Yeah. Because that's what we want to play games about, running out of gas. I don't even understand what it is I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, I'm out of gas. Oh no, I'm here, I guess. Uh... Have you bought any equipment yet? No. Or do you start out with any equipment, actually? I don't know. I don't think you do. What the... You need oh, yeah, a you... beam. Alright, let's go to the store. All right, we're going to the store. Remember when the Ghostbusters had to buy all their stuff? Yeah, you know, they didn't make it. <laughs> you know, I feel like at a certain point, even if you had no idea what Ghostbusters was as a programmer, the first question you would ask is, what is this game? What is Ghostbusters about? And what didn't happen was that instead, this guy was like, Ghostbusters. Well, they gotta buy their bu ghost busting equipment because they wouldn't have that. They uh, they were hired and they had to get ghost busting equipment because everyone knows ghosts exist. So clearly, you just gotta go to the store and and go get it. <laughs> so let's put a driving section in, and you can run out of gas. I'm going to run out of gas before I get to the store. By the way, I'm yeah. honestly don't know what they were thinking with this. Like, were they just trying to be ambitious or? Or what? I don't understand. To be oh, okay, we're here. All right, so we need to get a capture beam. Did you just leave? No, I'm here. No, I was talking about them. Like, get the beam. Oh. <laughs> vacuum and get another beam. All right, and in ghost food. Also, gotta love that you can only carry four items. Alright, so now we gotta... You need a trap. Okay. Let's just go fight Zul. You need a trap. They didn't say anything about a trap. <laughs> what am I doing? You're getting a trap. What, how do I get money to get a trap? Like, can oh, I... you gotta catch ghosts. But you need a trap to now catch you're the ghosts. Asking, what the fuck do you do to catch ghosts? Why well, you gotta get money? Are you starting to realize why this game fucking sucks now? <laughs> uh, why is this ghost just sitting there? But not only is it bad, it also makes no sense to play, which means like actually making fun of it is really fucking hard. I, uh... Oh, in, in other words, bitch, this is a good submission, but only because it's also a terrible submission at the same time. It's a catch-22. Because you're giving Kame something for the NES that's obtuse, which is like, he's never gonna figure it out and I don't blame him. He doesn't have an instruction manual to fucking work with. Can I stop now? Yeah, you can stop. <laughs> <laughs> we've, we've not busted any ghosts, and I don't think we will at this rate. I'd rather bust a nut than bust a ghost right now, to be honest. That is a great way to get me demonetized. 